Welcome back to the start of the game. It is a great day for hockey, and we are about to begin. The opening face-off and starting in Toronto. Washington's carrying it in their own end. Free puck thanks to the roadblock. Tried, but it didn't work. Puck loose, he couldn't get by. The Leafs have it at center ice. Is back behind the net. Puck is thrown to Backstrom. Chip to Wilson. Not a long pass, but effective. He's got it. Dogged determination there by Ovechkin. Pitching this one to Wilson. Toronto's with it now in center ice. Stole that pass away in his own end. Wilson's trying to work his way to center ice. Let's it go. Wonderful save. It didn't look like he had a thing to shoot at. The shooter thought he had a chance, but the goaltender robs him. What a stop. Just under five minutes played here in the first. Game still waiting for its first goal. Good offensive zone win. Good place to shoot from, and he does. Save there. His puck blocked off by Muzzin. Splendid pass through center to Kapanen. Let's it go. He scores! That is the first goal scored after a lot of work. Great start. They were ready to play, and it shows on the shot clock as well. And they take that neutral zone face off. Gathered up again by Johnson. Time of the goal. Took it away again. And the call is a penalty shot. No hesitation at all, Doc, by the official to make the penalty shot call on the trip from behind on the attacking player on the breakaway. Score! You get this close to the goaltender, the puck on your stick, you got to snap it quick. The video will reveal here that the goaltender was in excellent position. Sometimes the shot is just so perfect, it's unstoppable. Maple Leaf score. Scored by number 34, Austin Matthews. Time the Capitals are driving it from the wing. Great moves in the zone. Picks it up back there. Looking to Nylander. Toronto's got it in mid-ice. Shoots! The shot is off! That was a dangerous chance, but unfortunately, we don't use soccer nets in hockey. Connolly's tripped, and a penalty should be coming. Toronto sent to the box for two minutes. It's tripping. I'm going to give credit to the puck carry here. He kept his legs moving. He forced the back checker to reach in and take him off his feet. Washington's special teams practice is focused on the power play. Let's see if it pays off. Always important to win the special teams battle, or at the very least, come out even. Got his pad on that one. Tried the fake out, but lost. Nice work by Brown. Shot. Oh, terrific save on a great chance. The goaltender shuts that one down and a superb opportunity. Trying to go to Oshi. Driving in from no man's land. Oh, look at this! And now it's directed to Kapanen. That puck's loose. Good defense. Back on his stick. Collected. But can he beat him here? That shot came from right in front. He was standing in the lane and got some of it. Pass attempt to Brown. Directing that one to Tavares. It's all on his shoulders. Save! Couldn't have handpicked a better guy to be on a breakaway, and he stopped him. On to Marlowe. The lane was jammed, and it hit somebody. In with it now. He pulled it right back. Good poke check by Gardner. 
outmaneuvers his man in the zone. Let's it rip. Made that work for him in goal. That puck can't be reached by any play. The Maple Leafs with a face-off win. Toronto's got it in their own end. Pitching it to Gardner. Has that one measured at center. Snapping a pass to Eller. Just couldn't make it. Takes it in from the neutral zone. A shot. That shot came from nowhere. That great save was all positioning. And yet another save. How does he do that? And on top. Oh, what a hit. And there is a code for these things. The clock has bled down to the last minute. One minute left. In the first Whistle period. is blown. Penalty called. And the penalty box door swings open. Marlowe's getting a two-minute boarding mine. These are the type of plays, Doc, that we want to eliminate from the game where the attacking player has no chance to protect himself in getting hit from behind. Turned a shot on net. Chubbed that right away. Passing one off now to Verano. That puck came free. Could have been handled. The Leafs start the rush up ice. Backhander to the net. Got in the way of that one. He lifted the stick and picked his pocket. Twenty minutes have come and gone. A rest for the players as we prepare for period number two. Toronto struck twice. Two nothing. Second period about to begin here. Let's take a look back at the first. What stuck out for you? Washington's fallen behind after the first period because they haven't been able to possess the puck. They'll need to get on the attack if they want to push the pace going forward. We are underway. Power play time will continue here. Good job with the poke check. Let's see what the power play can generate as it's gathered in by Baxter. And quickly to Kuznetsov. Breakaway. Save. Oh, they had a great chance. Anderson's not had a busy night at all. He hasn't had a lot of shots to stop, but he's been sharp on the few that have come his way. Moving it to Marlow. It's dumped in. Icing is called. Washington's got that face-off win. Gets that one on a cross. Stays on side to the middle. This is tiring labor. Toronto's moving the puck in the defensive zone. Pitching this one to Marlowe. Right near the line. Muscled right off. Oh, what a stop. Great opportunity. Better stop. Skating with it now in the defensive zone. Puck is thrown to Backstrom. Looks ahead to start something. Propelled to Hainsey. And he dumps it in. Laid on to Verano. And he steps across the line. Corral. Let's it go. Got that in the trapper. Simple to describe that. Big glove save. A little over seven minutes have passed. The Leafs are ahead two to nothing. Pop dropped in the log jam, and the winger reached in and got it. Looking to Brown. Wonderful block. Great save. The Maple Leafs, in their own end, lug that puck along. Skilled play by Niskanen. Gathered up by Brown. Steps in from the neutral zone. Shot! He got a piece of that one. He had his eye on the puck the whole time. What a stop. 
Shoots one. Just missed the net. Well, that's a good scoring chance. He's trying to be too fine, trying to pick the corner. Sometimes you've just got to shoot it at the middle of the net. Puck loose, denied by the defense. Nice pass right up the gut. Cut that pass in his own end. Washington's in their own end, hoping to make a play to center. Trying to go to Kuznetsov. Cut off that pass at center ice. Puts one on. Save. The Capitals are moving the puck in neutral ice. Routine save, but a necessary one. Now it's directed to Nylander. Nice job done with the stick. A poke check frees things up a bit. Terrific save. Terrific opportunity. He's locked in now. Great save. Washington's given a minor here for tripping. This is an easy call for the official, Doc. The player made no attempt to play the puck and just tripped up the attacking player. Toronto's power play gets its first chance in this game tonight. It was a great opportunity for them on their first power play. Get the puck to the point, get it to the net, crowd the net for rebounds. Toronto's going back further to get restarted on this man advantage. Pass attempt to Tavares. Directing that one to Matthews. Offside play. They've won the faceoff. That's the end. Good work by John Tavares. Got it right back. Shoots. Wonderful save. He was hovering right over it. That was a tougher stop than it looked. Won that face off. Now what? Oh, and a missed pass, and the puck goes out. Tripped up on the play, and there will be a penalty. The Capitals suffer a tripping call. The Maple Leafs power play gets another chance to operate. Hasn't been effective yet. After an ineffective power play earlier in the game, let's see if they can get a little more organized, get the puck into the zone and get it on net far more frequently. Pitching it to Marlowe. Let's it go. Oh, what a glove he's got there. He lost possession there. Scooped up. With no time whatsoever, he turned it aside. You talk about cutting down the angle. Perfectly executed by the goaltender. Canes that offensive line. Waffle boarded. Pucks loose, denied by the roadblock. Clock about to bleed down to the final minute. Score! Three straight goals. Quick hands allowed him to snap that one off and score the goal. Well, he gets beat low on the stick side. Anytime a goaltender gets beat low these days, they're not very happy with him. The Maple Leafs have scored yet again, and it's late in the second. They've put together a 3-0 lead. A huge advantage in shots on goal, and maybe not much for the coach to say at the end of this period. William assisted by number 12. Flipped it toward open air. With a shot. Oh, that was close. He was hoping for a little bit more with that chance, but his shot is just off the target. Forty minutes have been played. Some hits given, some shots fired. But let's see what they have in mind as we get closer to the start of the third period and crunch time. Hey, fans, great to get We are entering the third period. Based on the first two, what are you expecting to happen? 
The Maple Leafs have had their way offensively, putting up a bunch of goals here through the first two periods of play. Let's see how they play it the rest of the game. Do they sit back or do they look to add to their comfortable lead? And that is an offside. Neutral zone face off one. Possession established here. Hammers one. Deflected off the blocker. And ring more bells on that one. One after another. Stopped. Icing. Washington's got it again. Slid to Ovechkin. And a save. Fires. Terrific save there. Didn't look like he had anything to shoot at. And he made it tough. Now that's a solid save. Snapping a pass to Marner. Tremendous job done defensively there with a the poke check. Passing one off now to Tavares. He lifts the stick and picks his pocket. Chip to Kuznetsov. Missed all of it. Terrific determination by Oshie. That is a shot that went way wide. I know that shot had a lot of heat on it, but if you put a soccer net there, it wouldn't hit it. Puck loose, just a speed bump off the defense. The Maple Leafs have their goalie at the bench, and they've replaced him on this delayed call. The Capitals have taken a slashing minor here. This power play has to find a way to get more people to the net. I agree entirely, Eddie. Let's see if they prove us right here. Nice face-off work. They didn't take advantage of the power play earlier in the game. Let's see if they can jump on the board here. And the pass goes back over the blue line, so they have to recoil. Moved along and in. Gathered up again by John Tavares. Lips wide. Right in that catching glove. Good work. Slips in. Loose pop knocked away by John Tavares. Just like shootout. Trying for it. Oh, what a brilliant save that was. Solid work there by John Tavares. Can't think of a better save than that. Lockered away. Snaps it to Kadri. And he's tripped and there'll be a penalty. Washington's got two on this one for tripping. This has been a power play that's gotten a lot of times, but no goals. Maybe that'll change with this one. Washington's prevailed on another faceoff. Moving it to Eller. He beats that charge into the zone. Terrific determination by Eller. Outstanding save. What magic to even get the shot away. A timely save. That is tremendously tremendous. This is ice. They won that battle in the docks. Save. Toronto's carrying it in the defensive zone. He's in on an onside play. Matthews is slashed, and the arm of the referee comes up to signal a penalty. The Capitals get a minor penalty for slashing. Toronto's power play has had plenty of chances. They just haven't scored yet. One of the biggest mistakes a five-on-three power play makes is they're looking for the perfect shot. The more you shoot it, the more you move the penalty killers around, and you start to tire them out. The Capitals in their own end, ready in attack. Hoping to make a play along the boards. Crosses that line. Nice work with the stick. Poked it right away. Scooped up by Wilson. A shot. That puck struck him in front. Score! A special team's goal while short. Washington's goal gets them to within two. There is still time, thus there is still hope. It's a good thing. Washington goal scored shorthanded by number. It's
dumped in. Loose puck. The defense was in the way. Pitching this one to Kempney. Puck is thrown to Eller. The Leafs have had plenty of power plays. This next one is over, and like the previous ones, empty. This plays incredible skill with that one. Free puck off a defender. That roadblock was set up. Into the end of attack. Wilson's tripped up. That should be a penalty. On to Backstrom. Loud pad save. Toronto's been assessed a minor penalty. Two minutes, and the call is tripping. Well, in desperation mode, all he was trying to do was sweep the puck away, but unfortunately caught the player's skates. He moved the puck around beautifully on the power play. Just nothing to show for it. I sure agree, Eddie. No matter how often you work on the power play, the ones that struggle go back to the same basic tenets. And it's to simplify things. Get it to the point, shoot it, get traffic, retrieve it, shoot it again. Whiffed on the shot. A drive. Great point blank save. You gotta think that's a game-changing save there. Propelled to Kuznetsov. Collected at the boards. Blocker save. It's gone and out of play. A clutch win of the faceoff there. Ooh, what a break. Shot hit the man. Gotta ice it here. Hyman's got to shovel it out of there. The Capitals go back to pick it up. Time is dwindling on this power play. The Leafs faced a power play at a key moment in the game and did away with it. Looking to Marner. Can start the attack going in the zone. Just a backhand. Didn't get through. Trying to go to Verana. It's an odd man rush, and how will they defend this one? Wonderful stop. Play is halted, and we have yet another penalty call. Gardner scoring to the box. It's a tripping minor. He's got great stick positioning. Stick is on the ice, but unfortunately takes the skates out from under him. There is hope with every man advantage, even if your percentage is poor. Are you listening? We're still waiting to see our first power play goal after all of these penalties. I understand, Eddie. The numbers don't lie, but perhaps this one can make a difference. Washington's going back to get restarted with their advantage. Nearing the final minute of regulation. Oh, she's tripped, and a penalty should be coming. Play is stopped, and that well-worn track to both penalty boxes will be plowed through again. Washington's power play gets another chance to operate. Hasn't been effective yet. Say! One of the biggest problems on a five-on-three is teams are too cautious. They don't shoot the puck enough, and they make it too easy for the penalty killers to kill it off. Into the attacking end. Right on through. Wonderful save. Toronto's back in its own end, trying to work forward. And now it's directed to Dermott. Cuts that pass off. Pass attempt to Kadri. And in flight over the line. Out in the slot. Wonderful save. What skill by both goalie and shooter. Now that's a timely save. A beautiful one. Kadri slashed. Ooh, that's going to be a penalty. That puck's loose. Deflected away by Baxter. The parade to the penalty box means a parade of special teams from the benches. Oh, that's a blatant slash, Doc. Anytime that you slide your bottom hand up your stick and swing your stick, you're going to the box. Terrific opportunity to cash in with a man advantage because it's four against three. There's not much new to a power play. It works the same way all the time. You get a good zone entry, you get the puck to the point, you shoot it, you move the penalty killers around. Let's see if they can do it this time. They win the draw. Let's see if it pays off. Laid on to Brown. A backhand shot. Over the net. Whoa. It was close. He's not going to get a better quality chance than that in front. 
The horn sounds. This game is over. The Leafs have hung on. They have hung on and gotten the win. It counts, but they stop playing with the big lead that they had at the start of the third period and get lucky and hold on for a win. So ends another game and another telecast. We hope you enjoyed this. Thanks for watching. Freddie Olchek and Ray Ferraro, Mike Emmerich saying good night.